What's up YouTube, Jeff back again. Today, another very exciting Samsung video for you guys. Samsung dropped a nice update to the camera for the Galaxy S23 Ultra, S22 Ultra, and the Z Fold 4 as well. Gonna talk about that update, how you can find it, uh, the quality improvements that I've noticed because the change log is a little sparse. So we'll talk about what things I've noticed along the way there. Um, before we get started, I do wanna remind you guys that we always appreciate my son Jonathan for giving us a dinosaur to hang out right over here. You can see here that we have the Spinosaurus right now and uh, he's hanging out with us in today's video. Also, if you guys wanna save some money on your wireless service, you can check out my partners over at Mint Mobile. Right now, they have one of their best deals of the year. Unlimited premium wireless is 15 bucks a month, which is 50% off the usual price for the unlimited plan. I've talked about their plans many times on the channel. They have a bunch of different plans. They have a five gig, 15 gig, 20 gig, and of course the aforementioned unlimited plan. Right now though, they're all $15 a month, so of course you want to go for the unlimited, which is 50% off. That is really the best deal. All these plans come with unlimited talk and text, nationwide coverage, and mobile hotspot included as well. You can get either an eSIM or a physical SIM. They'll also send you out a SIM tool if you need to pop out your old SIM, pop in the mint SIM, let the savings begin. I've been using them now for about nine months in the Phoenix, Arizona area. I've had fantastic service and uh, pay even less for wireless uh, while getting that service. That's what I love about mint. Right now, if you go to my link, which is mintmobile.com slash Springer, sign up for any three-month Mint Mobile plan, not only will you get this 50% off the unlimited plan that they have right now, and this is a limited time offer, so take advantage of it soon, you can also get a free smartphone case of your choice, just like the beautiful Arc Pulse. I'm going to send that smartphone case to you personally. I'm doing that, not Mint, just sending it out as a thank you for you guys giving them a try. All you have to do, again, is go to my link, mintmobile.com slash Springer, also in the pinned comment description. And now once you sign up, get in touch with me via Twitter DM or email, send me a screenshot of your order, and I'll ship out the free case of your choice to you as a thank you for signing up. We do appreciate Mint for being partners with the channel. So let's go ahead and talk about uh, this update. There's actually two updates that rolled out that are camera related. So I figured I'd talk about both of them in the same video because one of them is a smaller update. Uh, but there was a pretty important update for the camera that rolled out, and it's in the Galaxy Store where you'll find it. It's to the Expert Raw application. Now, the Expert Raw application, you can download separately uh, from the Galaxy Store on other devices, but at least on the Galaxy S23 Ultra, it's uh, baked right into your camera settings. So if you go into Camera, you'll go over here to More, and then you'll find Expert Raw here in the top left corner. So you can access Expert Raw from within the regular camera settings. But the update itself does come through the Galaxy Store, so we can scroll down here and take a look. This update arrived on July 5th, 2023. Uh, 2.0.10.6, 145.05 megs, so a pretty sizable update, which means it should bring some pretty nice improvements. If you look up here at the change log, though, it's pretty sparse. It says image quality improved and fixed errors. So it doesn't really say exactly what was improved. So I downloaded it and gave it a shot, tried it out. I'll tell you what I think kind of has changed a little bit, and also show you a couple of camera samples that I took um, as well. But um, if you don't know much about Expert Raw, basically it allows you to take photos in raw format which then allows you to edit them with something like Adobe Lightroom, pull out additional details, uh, change saturation of colors more easily and things like that. And Samsung's Expert RAW is a computational RAW, which means that it also adds some computational photography magic to the more traditional RAW format that you would get if you took it on like a DSLR camera um, or something more traditional like that. So if you open it, um, I took a photo earlier, a couple photos, but this is one of them, of the Spinosaurus that I mentioned earlier here in my office. And um, there's two photos you get when you take a photo in Expert Raw. You get the regular um, JPEG photo, and then you get the raw photo, which of course you can see, if you look at the size, is about 10 times larger because of that additional information that's there um, that you can then edit in, like I said, something like Lightroom. Uh, if you look at this image compared to the other images that I've taken in the past with Expert Raw, the colors are less saturated than they were before, for sure. Um, the colors are a little more subdued, and I think that's one of the biggest changes that has come with this update. I've seen some other people compare um, photos they took before and after. Unfortunately, this auto-updated on me in the Galaxy Store, so I didn't get a chance to take a before and after shot. Um, but you guys can play around with it. Let me know if you see the same thing. My colors are a lot less saturated when I take photos in Expert Raw now, and actually even more saturated, uh, less saturated, sorry, than when I take them with the regular camera app. And of course, Samsung is known for those really saturated popping colors, so some people might not like this, 
So you might not like this update if you really enjoy that style that Samsung has, but it makes the standard computational RAW and even the JPEG you get out of the Expert RAW app a little more true colors from the get-go. Of course, again, you can use Lightroom, which of course, once you add it to your Samsung phone, actually the icon shows up right here, so you can tap it and you can go right into Lightroom and you can start editing, you know, right in here. Um, I think I probably haven't, I really haven't done anything in there in a while, so it took a little second to open. Anyway, that is the uh, biggest change, but also I noticed some stability improvements when shooting without a tripod, uh, freehand, it seems like it's a little bit better at stabilizing the photos and a little bit shorter processing time as well um, from what I can remember from Expert Raw. It seems quicker at least. So you guys will have to let me know if you've noticed that as well. I highly recommend trying the Expert Raw app when I have time to take photos and I'm not taking them super fast. Um, if my son's not running around making you know quick movements, I try to use Expert Raw because I feel like I do get better photos, certainly ones that I can edit at a higher level. Uh, the other one that was updated was the gallery widget. Let me see if I can go in here and search for it. The gallery widget was updated. And uh, this is a smaller update, but the gallery widget is what allows you to put photos on your home screen from your gallery. 4.1.01.10, 4 4.5 megs on July 7th, just bug fixes. Um, but the gallery is a great um, application and widget to use. This is the Samsung gallery widget. They have some nice settings as well if you haven't played with them. If you go into the settings, you can choose which albums to show, and you can also choose the center and fill, fit to widget, or stretch to fill to make sure your photos look properly proportioned um, based on the widget size that you've chosen when you place it on your home screen. So definitely check out that update. I think some people were asking me on Twitter what that update does. All it does is improve the stability of the widget. Um, sometimes it would freeze if you had certain photos in there um, and things like that, and that has now been fixed. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification icon for future videos like this. Again, if you guys want to save some money on premium wireless and also get a free smartphone case from me, go to mintmobile.com slash Springer, sign up for any three-month Mint Mobile plan, get in touch with me via Twitter, DM, or email, and I'll get you guys that free case out as a personal thank you for trying Mint using my link. Appreciate them for being partners with the channel. Appreciate you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Thanks a lot.